Hi guys, it's me, Kasipi, yeah, I know. Strange face, huh? It's a long time I haven't made a video. Um, this video is just going to be a little update on the reason why you have not seen much updates from me. Um, reason number one is I realized that not too much people are interested in the videos that I um produce like I did a, a giveaway a couple months ago and only three people entered the giveaway and I have like what 60 something subscribers and I know that it was it took it took place in for instance of um Trinidad and Tobago only but I think majority of my subscribers are from Trinidad and Tobago and only three people entered the um the giveaway and that was just really disappointing for me but Nonetheless, three people entered. I thank you for entering when I was chosen. She got her prize and she was most grateful for it. And that's all I can that's all I can ask for, honestly, seriously. Um, so I think this will be the end of it for me and making easy videos and like you know, give giving that time and that energy because I really thought that as time go along. I will keep forward the internet videos, but I guess the content that I produce is not of interest to anyone. Um, people, not so much people comment on my videos or anything like that. I can count on my hand to be the three people that will always um comment on my videos whenever I do post one on that's Rana, that's um Nanny Bilbo and Anna Baby. Those three I can always count on them. Supporting me, whatever it might be, as well, whatever it might be. So, enough of that negativity. Um, I've been branching off into some new avenues, been, been gotten into a little bit of modeling, and I have my first fashion show coming up, and I'm really excited about that. So, maybe depending on how things go, I may do a little bit of vlogging on that to show you guys the excitement of that fashion show and it's a plus size fashion show curvy i'm not really plus size but i'm more on the curvy side i don't fit into the regular small medium large category of the korean that they make so i went up and i said hey let me give it a try and i was chosen and i'm like super super excited the show is in august and it's light cameras curved quoted red quoted red so if you're plus size or you wear from an extra large Go up the chicken that you check them out on Facebook. Awesome, awesome, awesome customer service and close to reasonable enough prices. I'm just in love. I'm 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 really excited about the new avenues I'm I've decided to take in my life and it's not the, the same boring stuff. It's you know it's new it's it's always exciting when you try something new. So I'm really looking forward to that and I'm Really, really, really excited about that. Um, what else can I share with you guys? Oh, I signed up for a rituals card. Um, let's say about like the first week in first second week in June because I realized I work close to rituals now and I'm always in there, like either getting a chill or coffee or something, something to eat, something of that nature. and one day I, I saw someone using a card and I asked them if they had a card and I was like, no, we don't have a card. So I was like completely upset with them for, for those couple of weeks. So I decided to sign up online for their card. So I visited their website and I signed up for the card and all of my information, like the name, the address, the contact number, email and all that good stuff. And I just got the card in the um the mail and this is um, the pamphlet that comes with. And it says global brands group of companies there are two first programs playing a free alert you got today and it's the pizza boys you know churches rituals tuna boys you know it shows all the um the companies that fall under this group and then you have the card in the center here i had used a little more saying your loyalty card is activated and ready to use you know so this is the card here it, it can touch it. So, it's only make a rituals purchase 
they, they said we call on the odd points state and if you accumulate enough points you can get like a free chill or free whatever but I think it's like um, every 10 points or something like is a dollar or every dollar is 10 points something along those lines but I, the website explains all that good stuff to you and it has the um where you can use it and how you redeem points or oh, one point is 10 cents sorry so if you want a, a caramel latte chiller which costs 25 dollars you need to have 20 250 points and a one second pizza personal pizza costs 30 dollars therefore you need 300 points so you can also use them at pizza boys as well and churches chicken and and rituals coffee house so it's not just for the rituals alone but i guess they just made that because it's more preferred to use. So I'm really looking forward to, to using this and you know. Yes, I keep making points and getting um my free chiller. Ah also I made my first Mac purchase. Really, really, really excited about that. Because I'm really like getting into the whole makeup and beauty stuff. I got the MAC um, Studio Fix Fluid SPF 15 and NC50. Um, I have only used it like twice and I don't know because Trinidad weather is so hot it's like hard for me to like do a review on my own self because to me it acts the same way as my regular foundations do it covers but to me you still see the like if I sweat you still see like a spot here and here and like on my chin but I guess that's my teaser areas and that always gets back it costs 235 euros this piece of crap I mean I think I need to test it out I need some more I don't use it every day so I'm gonna say I'm getting my money well as yet but Definitely in time, maybe if I decide to continue doing videos, I will do an update on that. I plan to get some more stuff as in my face and shoulder and lipstick glass and a few lipsticks, but that takes time because I'm not, uh, yeah, it takes time when you don't have paint suits. So yeah, I know I'm rambling in this video, but it's just an update video. Yes. So, I am supposed to graduate next year, um, next year May, and I'm thinking of going into hair, because I do my own hair, if you didn't know. Fabulous, isn't it? I'm just like in love with hair, I really am, but I, I, I've never done anyone else's, I've only done my own. But I really want to like have the experience and have and learn the proper techniques and when before I do some of it here because I don't want to make any mistakes and have anyone looking horrible and they didn't blame me and then I get discouraged and all that drama. So I want to do the proper way and the really proper techniques and because I'm always looking at new innovative hairstyles. I'm sure if you see me in a video it's like a different hairstyle. Yeah, that's me. I do this shit on my own. Because I'm about... Yes! <laughs> this is a total rumble. I am so sorry, but... I don't know. I'm just like in the mood to... To share. To block, to blow out everything. So, for now, this may be the last video you see from me. I might take like a long break, a long hiatus, and reinvent myself somehow and have more interested ideas to, to put forward to you guys so that I would get like more views and more comments and more support from you guys. I'm still going to support the local YouTubers because I'm the trainee that's what I do. I like, have to support. If you support me, I support you. 100 percent um this youtube thing is not some serious really take it to be i should say i don't take it as serious because it's an avenue for you to express yourself and to introduce things new things to people and like show all your ideas and your creativity and 
you know, share with people. That's the main purpose of YouTube to share with people. And I plan to do that, but I, I have been sharing, and you know, it's, it's just not working out how I thought it would work out. And I deleted like most of my videos. I only have like about five videos uploaded right now, and that's because I don't know. Ever since the giveaway and all this fiasco of going through the LinkedIn, like that just showed me that I really needed to. It broke my spirit a little bit and it just showed me that I really needed, need to reinvent myself and to bring more material and all this sort of thing so that I can get the, the response that I want. I'm not getting the response that I want from people and I don't know. I, I, don't, I don't know what's next for me but this is just a little update. Sorry about the rambling. <laughs> so guys. Thank you for having me and do enjoy. Bye guys.